I got a I got a badass phone call today. Oh yeah. So I think Charles the White. <laughs> You're <a> goofy. <laughs> so, so what do you? Because you know already. Once he sees this, he's going in on you because he does. That's what he does. Yeah, that's cool. I want you talk. willing to deal with that firepower that he's gonna come I at you with. You've to, seen him go at everybody. I want everybody. him to keep talking because the people that's around that, that's around us, they know he lying. That nigga say. My mama and Earl Smith's mama grew up together. They best friends. <laughs> Earl Smith Jr. mama from New York. <laughs> so you saying he lying about <laughs> Yeah, my mama, they, he said they, they grew up together, they best friends, no they not. My mama, my mama ain't never met Earl Smith's mama a day of her life. <laughs> <laughs> so, <laughs> me and him was cool, but he was much younger than me. <laughs> so, so <laughs> he just talking. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gonna talk. You know, Jordan's a pun. He ain't, he ain't a king or a boss. Explain. You just tell by his actions. Like a kid. Instead of calling me and telling me how he felt, he went to the internet. You know what I'm saying? But he got the right one now. Because <laughs> you can't threaten no jail shit with me. Uh-uh. <laughs> I ain't no gangster. I ain't never told you about no gangster shit. I ain't never told you none of that shit. He used to ask me every day, so what about number seven? Is seven really like this? Seven, like, uh-uh, seven ain't no gangster. I don't know what seven just, uh uh-uh, he just be rapping. Everybody around me just be rapping when we do no gangster shit. I ain't nobody do no gangster shit around. Think so you didn't man. trust him to tell him no, hell anything no. that really was going on, or did man, you trust him? Man, I let them in come to my house the, the, the last two months before my lease was up. <laughs> that was in March. <laughs> I've been gone. Also, the house that he's talking about. I've been gone. The address, because I heard yeah. it was he gonna drop link your yeah, address. Yeah, I've been gone. So that and then what he said. Yeah, that, yeah, yeah, link the address yeah, to the old clip wall. Yeah, that's that, 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 that. I've been gone. So look, that's why Mo three said everybody ain't your partner, everybody ain't your friend. Cause I thought he was my friend. Then yeah. he came back and said, "I'm gonna leak your address now nah, to the old cliff niggas." Nah, so you really is you really here for peace or you like like a war going on? What is you here for? Wow, that's crazy. What did you hear for? Then you say I didn't show up to the school, but a week ago you text me that. I, I'm gonna text some address. Oak Cliff niggas, your address. Why would I go to the school with you? How cause I wouldn't? How cause I wouldn't bond you out of jail? Wow. Two weeks. Two weeks ago we was cool. But when money getting vibe is something else. So you know it's a lesson learned though. You know you can't uh, you gotta watch everybody around you because sometimes they got a private agenda. You know what I'm saying? He told he said today, Rain take most of his artist money. I take twenty percent. Just manage the fee. I don't manage. Rain stole all that money from Mo three. Mo three now family know how much I'm getting. They know what I'm doing. I'm flying all over around the world trying to get this album together. When speaking of album, when you drop. I don't know yet. <laughs> you don't know yet. I was trying to do no, November, but I got a I got a badass phone call today. Oh yeah. So I think Charles the White. <laughs> You're goofy. <laughs> so, <laughs> so what do you? Because you know already. Once he sees this, he's going in on you because he does. That's what he does. Yeah, that's cool. I want you willing to deal with that firepower that he's gonna come I at you with? You've to, seen him go at everybody. I want everybody. him to keep talking because the people that's around that, that's around us, they know he lying. That nigga say, my mama and Earl Smith's mama grew up together. They best friends. <laughs> Earl Smith Jr. mama from New York. <laughs> so you saying he lying about? <laughs> yeah, my mama. They, he said they they grew up together. They best friends. No, they not. My mama, my mama ain't never met Earl Smith's mama a day of her life. <laughs> <laughs> so, <laughs> me and him was cool, but he was much younger than me. <laughs> so, so <laughs> he just talking. What? Well, I mean, then he came back and said, "You know, you know, you told me about that about that retarded mo three baby mom." <laughs> Why you never said that about a retarded baby mama? I might say to baby mama, they want some money, not no retarded. I mean, not no slow baby mama. Come on. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gon' talk.